Warning, I swear a lot. Welcome to Deltarune Chapter 2, which finally came out like, I don't know what, three years later, completely out of nowhere and completely upending my schedule, as I'm sure it did for so many other people. But Chapter 2 is out. That's a pretty big deal. I did the first chapter on this channel ages and ages ago, and I honestly, honest to God, would not recommend you go back and check it out because it's old as shit and not nearly as good as what I do now. Which isn't to say what I do now is great, it's just better than it used to be. But I went through this entire, the entirety of chapter one last night to get myself caught up and everything in the game and make sure I'm not missing any details. We could give it a look. And I'm excited, I'm actually genuinely excited. This is as much for me as it is for you. Who keeps laughing at me? If this is a fucking prank, I swear. Chris. Yeah, because the last one ended on a real fucking stinger, didn't it? Which I'm assuming was a dream, but anything's possible. Chris, honey, are you awake? You better be, you little shit. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. Is that a... Is it a knife? Yeah, it's a knife. Is that a knife? No, it's totally a dream. It's gotta be. Yes. Fucking called it. Chris, did you eat all of the pie? I did not. I did not eat all of the pie, I swear. He's sleepwalking. But why would he have a knife? Maybe to cut the pie. I'm piecing this together. Fucking game theory, step aside. Oof. It is your knife in this empty tin, is it not? Why do I have my own knife? Oh, Chris. Am I going to have to lock the oven again? Yes. Yes, you will. Guaranteed. You're taking it a lot better than my parents would have. It's time for school. Again. I can't wait to go hang out with nice Susie. Because that character shift, she's cool. Oh, she was cool, but she's cooler now. It's a birdcage. When the door's closed, there's no escape. That doesn't make me feel better. That had to have been a dream. It had to have been. Because what the fuck was he doing his big scary sequence of like, I am evil now. It's five dollars. No. It isn't yours after all. No, it's not. On the computer's desktop is a folder called Epic Games Stuff. It's a poorly drawn design for a game. Seems the last boss is a creature with giant rainbow wings. Man, what a shit game that would be. Doesn't seem like this game ever saw the light of day. I can't imagine a game like that would ever see the light of day because it would suck. Underneath the bed is an old cartridge of Cat Pairs RPG. Now that's a game. I mean, I'm going to do the traditional Toby Fox game playthrough tradition, I guess, of literally looking at everything, but I will cut some of it out so it's not horrific for you, where you're literally seeing me interact with these books. There's no time to read books, just generally, and there's no time for you to watch everything I look at. Cactus. There's not much to say about it. How to draw dragons is at the bottom of the drawer. The purple character on the cover is dressed immodestly. Your brother will never return this book. Three hours later. Is it the time for day two of the school time? Shall we go? Yes, let's go. I'm excited. I want to see what's going on. It's not playing the music this time. Nope, we skipped right ahead. I'm late. Even Susie showed up before you. Hey, Susie is here, actually. That's strange. Hey, Chris. If I knew you were going to be late, I wouldn't have showed up on time. Dumbass. Susie, please don't kick your desk. Treat school property like you treat people. That was poor advice. Hmm. Okay. Next time I'll aim for the vitals. Yes, good. What are the vitals of a school desk? <laughs> See, she's in a happier mood though. I like it. That, that's not what I... Yeah, in any case, good morning class. We have a lot to go over today because we did nothing yesterday. First, we're starting the reading from page 142. Any volunteers? Any at all? Ah, oh, Noelle will do it. Noelle's thinking about it. She said, I guess I could read. Them. Ah, trouble yourself not. It is I, <laughs> the true hero of this game. I will valiantly take this blow of humiliation, you smug prick. Ahem! <laughs> smug piece of shit. Page 142. It was the best of times, it was the worst of times. It was the best of times, it was the blurst of times, you stupid monkey! Times are pretty good, times are pretty bad. Mediocre times, iffy times, so-so times. Thank you, Birdly. Listening to this, you began to fucking die. Holy shit. Have a nice day, everyone. <laughs> and please remember the group projects. Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. 
Oh, Chris, uh, did you fucking fall asleep in my class? You were sleeping all class, literally all day, from nine to three or four, depending on what school you went to. Don't, don't worry, I'm not mad, just concerned. Did you not sleep at all? Usually you only sleep through the start. Good luck and, and rest well tonight, okay? I suppose so. Uh, the wallpaper's been updated. The buff embracing heroes are now edited to be four inches apart in order to keep it family friendly. Leave room for Jesus. Susie! My dude, what's cracking? Well, look who it is, the school zombie. She really looks like Yamcha. I don't know what this Yamcha is, but it sounds disappointing. You're sleeping like a corpse, all class. Uh, what's the matter? Had trouble going Betty by last night? Yes, as I always do. Huh? Me too, Chris! <laughs> like I could sleep after yesterday. Just waiting for today felt like years. Did all that stuff really happen, or was it a d game of D&D that got too real? Lancer, Rousey, everyone, are they still... Do they exist? Look. You've been wondering the same thing, right? Come on already! <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! We're gonna walk in there, it's gonna be a normal fucking room, isn't it? It's just gonna be the supply closet. All right, Chris, this is it, moment of truth. Everything we've been waiting for is just behind this. If we uh, open this and there's nothing inside, she might kill me. Will uh, we still be? Yes. Screw it. Let's just open it already. Uh, uh, Susie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hello. I am Susie. Hi. Hello, Noel. Noel. Hey. What the hell are you doing here? Oh, I'm sorry to bother you, but... Uh, well, I just... Birdly and I were going to the library to do some research for a group projects, and... It's okay, would you want to come too? Oh, Chris, you can come too, I mean. Fucking thanks, Noel. I appreciate the invite. <laughs> Fucking... It's invited second after Susie. Who was literally the town pariah? Uh huh. I I mean, we're like uh, busy with uh... Chris. Help. What are we doing? <laughs> Hanging out alone in the closet. Crime. You know, just committing crimes. Just gonna do some crimes and go to jail. Don't pass go. Forever. It sucks. Oh. Uh, that sounds just... Have fun, you two. I'll, um... Not be in jail. Chris, if you could bring her by later, it would mean a lot to me. Um, actually, wait. Wait a second. Susie, I, uh, I have something for you. <gasps> Plot twist. The fuck? Okay, see you, bye! <laughs> this is good. I like this. Um... It's a lunchbox? Full of chalk? I didn't tell her shit. Susie, I didn't tell her shit. No, no, on this playthrough, I legit did not tell her a goddamn thing. And I know I didn't last time as well, because I wouldn't rat out my dude. I did not tell her, I swear. I did not tell her, I did not. Fuck. She had chalk the whole time. <laughs> and didn't give it to Alphys. <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Here, you hold it. You got the chalk. <laughs> Wait, Chris, what the hell is that? <laughs> Why would Noel ask me to do homework with her? Death wish much? Does she want to fail? Wait a second. Wait a second. The curtain of this mystery has been pulled back. Chris. Did you notice how nervous she was? And like, blushing and stuff? Chris, you don't think she, uh... She's onto our secret identities, which are literally the same names as we normally have, if you recall. You know, this Dark World stuff. Damn, we gotta keep this under wraps, Chris. This is our thing, you know? Anyway, enough waiting already, right? Let's go. Let's go. Let's fucking go. It's, there's gonna be nothing in there, I s- Oh no, for it. No, there's nothing in there. I know for a fact. 
Oh. No, it is working. That was a dope ass entrance. Okay, we're in it. Let's go. We're at the town. It looks exactly the same. Mm. Here we are. Chris, Susie, it's me, person who looks like Azrael, but not. It's been ever so long. Yeah, yeah, it's been what, a day? I bet it's been more than a day. Oh, that is short, isn't it? It's just that I've never had friends before preaching to the choir, bruv. So I've never waited so long to see them again either. Fine, guess we'll try not to let you die of loneliness, no guarantees. I bet Lancer wants to see us too, right? I swear to God, if he's dead, I'm going to be fucking livid. Hey, wait a sec. Where is Lancer? Where is he? Where is he? Sniff him out. Where's everybody? No one was here to begin with, Susie. This place was always empty. Worry not, Susie. You'll see them in a moment. Just wait here, all right? Okay. Okay. Let's better not be some kind of prank or something. Or fuck it, I'll murder everyone. I'll go straight back to being a murder hobo, I swear to Christ. Chris, I have something to ask you. I need you to return to the light world. What? I just got here. And go to the old classroom, to the east of the closet doors. Inside, gather everything on the ground. And bring it back here, could you? How the fuck do you know about- But what? Hmm. I'm gonna talk to you again. Chris, go to do the thing I said. It's where you returned to the Warlight World last time. Head east after you exit the Dark World. Hello. Mr. Rousey, you're not gonna put your hat back on? Why? D did I look cuter before? Uh, no. I just mean... Y you think I look cuter now? It was just nicer seeing less of you. Making me blush. Hurry the hell up. Longer you take, longer I gotta spend with this guy. If you're bored, Susie, we could croquet some croquet cro We could something team scarves. Wait, crochet? That's it. That's the that game with the hammer? So that's like knitting? Alright, long as I get to use the hammer. So are we gonna be able to actively go back and forth between the light and dark worlds now, or...? Are they teasing us with the dark world and then just gonna be like, fuck you, nerd, go back to the real world. Ah. It is a D&D &D thing, isn't it? Well, I don't know, actually. More a case, like, maybe of, like, lightners being able to manifest things in the dark world. They require our presence. They require our... I don't know, man. I don't fucking game theories. And turn it into a giant dusty ball on my head. This is a good time. And how is Chris doing? Ah, plot, drama, espionage. They're great, Tori. One of my favorite students, a real star. Hmm. Oh, how wonderful. They've not been up to anything strange. Haha, <laughs> no, they've been skipping class, sleeping all day. They're normal. Well, that is relieving. I have just been a little concerned lately. Just lately? You take it easy too, Alphys. I am always cheering you on, alright? Uh, th th thanks. Can't let Mom find out you're balancing a giant trash orb. Look, she would accept you. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. Door is locked. Okay, back to the dark world. Stop torturing myself with not being back there. How did this stay on my head? Ah, there we go. I wish I could enter places in such a manner. Hey, Chris, where is every... Here they come. One. There they are. Wow. Guess who's back, clowns? <laughs> Best character in the game by a country mile. And that's in a game with a lot of good characters. Lancer. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Chris, don't know what you did, but hell yeah. Everyone's here, even rules card. But, uh, what happened to, uh, Lance's castle? Oh, gone. Gone? Right. When Chris sealed the fountain, that dark world disappeared and the castle fucking exploded and turned back into a normal classroom. Oh? So where's Lance gonna live now? Don't worry, Susie. We'll conquer Rousey's castle as our own. <laughs> yes. 
Chris, as you bring Dark World Denizens back here, the power of our fountain will transform this town more and more. From now on, the enemies we spare will be recruited to our town. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So let's keep sparing enemies, okay? Anyhow, why don't we all have a look around? We can head north towards the castle. I have a special surprise to show you there. Bear me a cake, you promised. Aha! Not if I surprise myself first, bitch. Last one there is a fresh and fragrant egg. Man, I want to be a fresh and fragrant egg. Come on, Chris, you let him beat us. I won't be an egg. Hey, hey, room, room. Hey, guy. Ah, thou hast transplanted us to thine castle town. And truly, a magnificent town of castles it art. But ho, oh, hmm, something art lackingeth, it feeleth. Couldest thou guys, perhaps, bring in an evil ruler or something? I love doing that. The Lancer hath pronounced me vice father. Forth hence I do all the cooking and cleaning. Perhaps I should seek a new employer. I love that guy. He's the best. Hey. Oh, welcome to Foreman Town. Fucking finally. Fucking finally. Fucking finally. After all these years, it's my town. I played Pathfinder Kingmaker, where I actually have my own barony, and it does not feel as satisfying as this. Party dojo? Can I go in? Oh god, I can. Oh my Christ, there's a lot to do, isn't there? No wonder this took three years. It's a bed for three people or one three-headed person. Hey, hey, boss. Boss. Eh, I'm so glad to have a nice boss. I could shed a tear. But I won't. I'm on the job. I'll cry at home with the kids. Boss, you're strong. But there's always time to learn. The next step after tutorials is training. So me and the boys got you together at Dojo. Complete our battle challenges and get some fabulous prizes. Meanwhile, you might get a little bit tougher. We're gonna make you the strongest boss. I'll do a challenge, yeah, fuck it. Whoa. Joe's life savings, a hundred bucks, and a club sandwich. Club sandwich is good. Learn how to spare like a chip. Why don't we do that? Why the fuck no? I can do whatever the hell I want. If it's boring, I'll just edit it out. Boss! You can act and spare on the same turn. If you know Chris's act will give an enemy 100% mercy, it's almost as if I did this on my entire last playthrough that you guys didn't see. Spare them on the same turn with Susie or Rousey. This music's dope. I'm gonna turn the volume on my head thing. Hell yeah! I'm gonna shave him. And then Jigsaw Joe jigs in. Spare him. Wait, what's that new thing? Oh, mercy. So you can see how much you are mercying them. You shaved his stubble. Oh, dope. He looks fine as hell. Oh, boss, you're sparing me? Yeah. Wait a second. I got something else to remind you of. Boss! It works the same with making an enemy tired. If an act will make an enemy tired, use Rousey's pacify right away. Of course, pacify is magic, so you'll need toilet paper. Spend a turn defending the game, TP, if you have to, boss. Jigsaw Joe looks like he could use a bedtime story. Sleepy story. Susie told the enemy a bedtime story about beating them up. The enemy became tired. Jigsaw Joe drank coffee. Jigsaw Joe, stop being tired. Jigsaw Joe will keep fighting. Boss, you're putting me to sleep. I mean, you aren't. Make me tired. Pacify, boss. Can you do it now? Yes, you can. Another bedtime story about dying. You did it, boss. You can manage to spare enemies right away. Battles will go a lot faster. That's all. Cool. An amazing battle. As promised, here is your reward. My entire life savings. <laughs> One dollar. Yeah, because I gave that to him last time. Thank you, Joe. Appreciate it. I'll do another challenge. Why the fuck not? Apparently there are rewards. Get 100% TP without getting hit. You can do it, boss. Yeah, I can do it. Yeah, I can do it. 
Time to flex my fingers. Graze! Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. No, you stop. Fuck. Fuck. Stop. No. Why? Oh, right. You have to keep... Oh, I see. Oh. Oh, this is a challenge. Fuck. The bullets aimed right at you. They're moving one direction bit by bit. Thanks. Okay. I oh, will... Obviously, I'm going to do this because... Fuck. Graze. Oh, that's why it's called graze. You have to let them graze you to get to 100% TP. This is a little trickier than you would think. Oh, oh, that was close. No, it's getting faster. Initial positioning is actually really important to make sure you don't get trapped. Like I am now. <gasps> Ugh. I've got it. I'm sorry for my clacky keyboard. I really am. I tried to move things and it, it just didn't work. 98. God, you're killing me. Yes, I got it. Okay, good. Fuck. All right, good. Amazing battle. As promised. 100 bucks, which was 100 times his life savings, which must be depressing. All right. We'll do the Clover rematch. Why the fuck not? I can do with it. So I remember how to do this. Topic long, longer time to guess. Choose a topic that Clover likes. Crime. No thanks, wrong. Is it that bad? Oh, this is, uh, this is different. Oh, this is not a rematch. This, I mean, actually it doesn't, a rematch doesn't necessarily mean it'll be the same. I see. It's all right, I've got this. Giant bed. That's right. Not bad. It's okay. How much you know what? You know nothing. Sorry about this. I'm glad that the uh, ah, battle music is the same because I really like Rude Buster. Jesus, this is not going well. How mercy? 25%. Yeah, I was worried about that. Tree. That's right. Not bad. It's okay. I might actually lose this. Might actually lose. Oh, I beat the Javel. I can beat you. What was it? 50, 56% very specifically. Number three. That's right. It's okay. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. It's cool. Ah! Family. Yay! Alright. I just gotta survive. Can you survive? Ow! No. No, I can't survive. It's too hard. Get rid of them. There we go. Amazing battle. Club sandwich. I love sandwiches. I do. So I guess I've done them all. Yes, I have. Hey, Blocky, Bloxer. Finally, a dojo for people that are normal shaped like me. I will train myself for the tournament. Reach our monthly funding goal. I will now talk about our hole. It was dark, filled with dark dollars. Fed from subscription by our followers. Working hard, no bank, no lender. We received one unit of legal tender. Thanks for donating. You're welcome. Thanks to you, Commander, we've been liberated. I hereby declare today National Ham Sandwich Day of Independence. Good. Mom Amoeba, welcome to Top Bakery. Our special chefs spin baked goods at the top of their class. I'm having an absolute blast. Oh, it's Hammer Boy. And that sweet little boy who looks suspiciously like Lancer. Hello. Oh, I am Chef Lancer. Try my delicious hand-formed cookies. They are free for a price. What's the price? Zero dollars. I will take a cookie. I now pronounce you cookie and wife. Lots of cookie was added to your items. Lots of cookies, want one? You already took your cookie. Wait, I'm still regenerating from the last one. Where does it come from then? Well, well, welcome to Top Bakery. I am this bakery smith, Malleus. I do not know what any of these strange tools are for. But using my skills, I can fuse items to create new ones. Chat. 
bread? What is this technique you speak of? True mysteries were no more said than this moment in which they were spoken. There's Sean. I miss you, buddy. I love this track as well. So here we are now in a new world. And right off the heels of defeating that clown. Incredible. Oh, what's that? It seems like he gave something to you. That's right. You must not have noticed it. That crystal. It's nearly invisible, but you've been holding it this whole time. Could have fooled me. Here, I'll take it off your hands and appraise it. Incredible. To think he had a shadow crystal. Amazing. I don't know what that is. Shadow crystals? So cool because you can only see their shadow. Cool in a premonition, but I get the feeling you may find more of these. You continue to defeat strong adversaries like him, that is. If you can gather more shadow crystals, bring them. Here. Now. I'm sure I can stitch together something fucking weird for you. Let's check the cafe. Ah, oh, oh, it's Mom Amoeba Man. Mom Amoeba, I wanted to run the bakery, but someone is already working there. A cafe that serves pastries. What a disgrace. What sort of humiliating thing will happen next? Find out next time. Check recruits. Chapter one, level two. What the fuck? What, what is this? Is this just like a bestiary? It seems to be. Said to be someone's best friend, but maybe not. Shine on you, lazy diamond. A shape-changing fighter. Ironically, blocking is not his forte, because he only has one arm. It's hard to block with one arm. Prize? Mom Amoeba, you return my cake to me. Moi. I will never forgive your kindness. Forget your kindness. That's an important distinction. Every day, I will give you dizzying flavors. Every day, the flavors will become stronger. That's the power of Baker's arms. You got a spin cake. Dope. Hey. Hey, hey boss, I'll have a dark candy star fay. I'm not a waiter. Sure it's great to be here with my best friend, friend, best friend, half that one. Castle Town is transformed from the power of friendship. You are filled with the power of friendship based architecture. That's good. I appear to have recruited all of these because I pretty much just attempted to be nice to everyone. Although I did skip quite a few fights during this playthrough, so that might change things. Hard to say. There's a little boob. It's a bit scary moving to a new place, but as a ball, there's nothing to sphere except sphere itself. What about you, the guy wearing Rousey's hat? Oh, he's a cat rack. Prince Rousey, I will keep your hat erect until you need it. What a stand-up fella. Until then, please allow me to pretend to be a wizard. Hiya! Just wanted to show off your huge house, huh? A giant house with things like central heating and a working toilet. No. What I want to show you is upstairs. It's my sick-ass race car bed. Oh, I nearly forgot. This is where I cook. You cook everything in a giant witch's pot? Of course. Cauldron cooking is very convenient. Here, Chris, Susie, have a cake. Holy shit. Good catch. A little thick on the frosting. Th that was for sharing. Hey, anyone was free to make an interception. I mean, you're right. Okay, now make a chocolate one. Why don't we go upstairs first? I could go for a chocolate cake right now, I'll tell you what. Wait, what's down here? Living quarters for bad guys. I want to check that. Wow. It really is a living quarters for bad guys, isn't it? It's violently protecting the jail. God damn, that thing is intimidating. We're still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay. We've grown to love this hellish place where we dress as animals. So, deviant art? Are those... We decided to dress as kings. It's cultural exchange. That is very progressive. Oh, it's Fat Boy. Oh, it's Douchebag. Uh, the lightness. Will you come to humiliate me? I might. He's got a giant hamster wheel and a warble. <laughs> He's a hamster. Nah. Mr. King, the light has returned everyone here safely. If you're willing to reconsider, then... What? Live in a kingdom ruled by you? Lightner's little patsy. 
Staying in this cell is far less humiliating. Yeah, keep telling yourself that. Now, if you will excuse me, my giant hamster wheel is getting cold. We have nothing to discuss. Okay, bye. Do we have something to discuss? By the way, is my son happy? Yes. Like you care. You were gonna throw him off a cliff. Actually, it was a castle, but yeah. Uh, your prejudice made my bluff too effective, I see. Besides, even if I threw him, he would just bounce. My son is a bouncy little pumpkin. Oh, cute. We're done talking to you. Oh, I have a surprise for you two. I made rooms for you in the castle. That's dope. Rooms? So you can stay here whenever you want. Um, I'd be happy if this place could be like a second home to you. A place that you can go, no matter what's happening outside. Mm. Well, well, we'll take a look. I ain't making no promises. I mean, if, there's not, if it doesn't have a bidet, I don't fucking care. Don't waste my time. Where's my, what's my room like? It's nice. It's a nice room. It's a wardrobe full of all sorts of different clothes. You can wear whatever you want. I won't, but I could. This is a fucking stand for your manual. Good God, don't forget the manual. I thought you might want to keep it here in case you want to read it. I don't want to read it. It's my bed. It feels incredibly soft, like sleeping on a dream. Nudge, nudge, hint, hint. Some decorative moss. Looks delicious. Why the hell does your room get moss? Let's check out Susie's room. You know it's going to be dark. Oh, Lancer gets the coolest room. Damn you, Lancer. This is pretty cool. And Susie, this is your room. Uh, I tried to make something you'd like, but you can put anything else you want in here too. Really hope you like it. Hmm, hmm, the sounds of inspecting. Hmm. My own room, huh? I guess that's pretty cool. My own room, like this. How long did it uh, take you to do this? Well, uh, since I last saw you two, I... Bam. Man, you're a real weenie. You know that? You weenie. <laughs> I think she likes it, Chris. Also, ow. Ha, <laughs> jealous I got the cool room. Look, Chris. I mean, we haven't been to Lance's room yet. Settle down. Cool. Spike bed. Now I can stab myself during the night. Finally, some convenience. Damn, there's everything in here. Pine cones, chalk, moss, jars of salsa. Fucking love salsa. Pieces of ice, black crumbs from the toaster, jawbreakers. Oh, and like actual food too. Dope. Susie, you didn't get to read the manual. So I put it over here for you. Cool, I'll read it before bed. That'll put me to sleep. Got him. It's a clothes drawer full of spiky and dangerous clothing. All the clothes are ripping each other up into shreds. Hell yeah. Also, fun thing I think I just noticed is that this track that is playing right now is, I believe, a remix of the Chaos King fight music, which is dope. Or like, not a remix, but you know, a remake. It was a squelch. <laughs> Hi, Lancer. Lancer, you aren't gonna believe how sick my room is. A room as sick as you what I want to see. I'll keep digging holes until I reach your room. It's got a door, you know. A door? Wow, Peach Boy, you went all out. I love that my floor is full of holes. Me too, Lancer. Wow, it's better than I remember. I even have my own bed now. Now I don't have to sleep in a hole anymore. I thought you already had a bed. No, that was for the bike. Ah, oh, yes. Is that a fish? Some kind of digging implement, like a trowel. It's a music player, listen to the contents, yes. I see. It's full of cartoon splat noises. I should download some of those. <laughs> That's weird. Can we not go up here? Hey, what's up here? Oh, just more rooms I'm renovating. I'm also, I apparently I can, I'm a fucking tradesman. So is your room up there? Uh, yes. I still I haven't dusted it, though. 
Yeah, like we need to see your nerdy glasses collection anyway. Damn. Damn. Way to kick him while he's down, Susie. So what do we do now? Feel free to explore the town until you're ready to leave. <laughs> like we're gonna leave now, right? 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 I mean, what else are we doing? Oh, it's quite a wonderful town, really. Thank you. So, why am I alone here? Bit of self-reflection, I suppose. I do realize I was quite a coward before. So, I wanted to say, well, I still am! My cards, I cannot handle society. For now, I'll be living at the top of this cliff. When I'm ready to meet society again, I will be back. Thank you. Thank you for the wonderful home. I will not use it. Farewell, friend. There's a hole in the wall. There's nothing inside. What an absolute pile of crap. There's that man. I mean, that is presumptuous, but you know. Miss Society left, didn't he? Hmm. I reckon I knew in this one wouldn't happen. It's not no fault of yours. He'll and be back one day. Without trees, I must gain nutrients by eating clothes. Such is the way of the worm. We'll go find a tree then. Looks like the clothes are nibbled. Take a bite. Yes. You put your mouth against the mannequin's cheek. Chris? Don't bother. It tastes awful. And Susie? I suppose we leave now? Wait, Chris, we're leaving? But we just got here. Man, I don't want to go to a group project. That shit's lame for dumb nerds. Oh, you two have homework. Uh, well... Susie, Chris, you ought to do it right away. School's important. Uh, fucking thanks, Rousey. Appreciate it. It's helpful. I banish you from this kingdom until you start your project. Mm. <laughs> Damn it, I forgot he was the prince of this place. Hey, Lanza. Susie! Don't worry. I'll go and help you too. Uh, wait, Lanza, perhaps you shouldn't. Too late, kind boy. In friendship form. Uh... Lancer was added to your key items. What? Where'd you go? Don't worry, I just entered your inventory. I'll just be hanging out in Chris's pocket. Like the sweetest little pumpkin. Don't know what that means, but okay. Fear not, I too shall assisteth. Ah, uh, we're good, thanks. Aha! Uh -huh. Quite! We, as a team, art good! Rules became a key item, even though no one wanted that. I mean, I did. I have to be honest, I 100% did. Hmm. Alright, enough already, let's get going. Good luck today, Chris. See you soon. Thoweth! I'm so excited. Let's get out of here, my dude. That was dope. Oh, damn. Guess we gotta do our project. <sighs> At least we got Lancer, right? He's not gonna be conscious out here, for sure. Lancer, where are you? Damn, guess he skipped out after all, huh? Hmm, so where should we do this? What? Library? Ugh, fine. I'm gonna check my items. I mean... Christ, bullet cards. Cards, the jack of spades and the rules card. Very good. Rules card, ah, I literally just got his name. You held the cards. They felt flimsy between your fingers. Be fucking careful with them. Looked at the ball of junk in admiration. Nothing happened. Ah, Chris, you were going to do your project. Oh, are you calling to ask for my help? No. I will go find our homemade scented glue sticks. I changed my mind, I want your help. Oh, you have a partner this time. Chris, that's wonderful. I hope they like butterscotch scented glue sticks. Oh, that sounds amazing. Click. That actually sounds incredible. I have two dollars in real life, man. What a life simulator. Uh. Well, this is quite a sight, isn't it? <laughs> Undyne, you're an absolute champion. Hey, buddy. Uh, the dog was doing donuts, so I sped over here. 
But I just learned Donuts is actually the name of a special attack for cars. Why is my life stuck in a loop of doughy disappointment? My life, like a donut, is stuck in a loop of doughy disappointment. Hey, Undyne, how's it cracking? Oh, hang on, let's talk to you first. That's Metal Crusher played on <laughs> fucking car horns. The traffic's moving at a snail's pace. I love snails. Could today get any better? Damn, I was just directing traffic as normal when a little dog drove one of those toy cars into the middle of the street and started doing donuts. In the chaos, all the cars in town got jammed up. Thankfully, no one was hurt, but ordinary citizens like you gotta get out of here. I've got some heavy lifting to do. Don't interrupt me when I'm lifting. <laughs> Go to the library. Hey, Suze. All right, we're here. School. Goddamn project. Books. Goddamn. Crazy about them. Hmm. Hey, Chris. Where the hell is everybody? Something seems kind of off. Screw it, let's just go and play Space Pinball in the computer lab. Fuck yeah. Um. Huh? It's like. It's like that other thing. The inside of the closet? Chris, you don't think this could be. Another Dark World? Well. Guess this means we can't start our project. Unless... You know, Chris. If there's a dark fountain in there, you can seal it. And it'll turn back into the computer lab, right? So what's it gonna be, Chris? Let's go! Let's go! Yeah, let's just drop the act. Our last adventure was great, right? I couldn't stop thinking about having another. I don't know what's in there, but... We can't live if we don't find out, right? Come on, Chris. As if she would go use the computer in my house. Fuck that. She would never agree. Ooh. This is new. It is new. You're correct. It's a cyber planet. We. Hello there. The wires. The wires! Mm. Okay. Oh. Oh, this basket of eggs again. Oh. Oh, oh, ow! Why is this harder than I thought it'd be? Excuse me. Hello there, same person. Everyone was... Mm. There's a lot of you. Everyone else has been... Save us, she's gonna... Pre! Somebody help me! Whoa! Somebody please! It's Noel. Susie? And also that I'm here as well. Hello. Hi, I'm actually standing in front. Cool that you're here, just... Wait, get out of here before it's too late, it shit's nuts! Huh. Bye, Noel. <laughs> Hello there. Hell of a study session. Huh. Who, who are you? I am known as serial number Q5U4EX7YY2E9N. You foolish children may call me. Queen, the best uh, Phantom Thief member. <laughs> like we're gonna call you Queen. Q five U three seven. Uh, Queen, Queen. Well, look, Queen. We're not children. Teens are merely big children, and adults are even bigger children. Stupid becomes big stupid. You get yes. Doesn't that make you a child too, then? No, I am a computer. Smart. Computer? Well, thank you for the stimuli, but I must leave now. Goodbye. 
Whoa, 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 wait, 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 why'd you capture Noel? I would have captured you too, but I ran out of cages. Why are they capturing? So that she may become my willing peon in my quest for world domination. Yes, because Noel's going to help you do that. Also, maybe I will make her face into a robot one. What? Why? Seems cool. Well, forget it, dude. Nobody's turning anyone's face into a robot. Could that be a statement of animus dissension? Huh? You want to fight, loser? <laughs> yes, yes, yes! <laughs> oh, then bye! Wait! For a goddamn second! I have no time for such frivolities and would kick your ass. But perhaps someone else could entertain you. Oh. Oh! Enjoy your assimilation. Where wires swung in? They're tired. Oh, but we don't have Rousey with us. I see. Jiggle, jiggle. You defend. You jiggled your body. The wire loosened in turn. Oh, I'm jiggling so good. So good. <laughs> Fucking Christ. I'm getting um true lab vibes for real. Ah. 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 Ow. A very sneaky gambit you played there, sir. I am impressed. Throw wire. Toss Chris to free wire. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, C. Oh, two for one. Go on, son. Oh, here we go again. Ah! Ah! Ooh! Ah! No! Ah! Oh, jeez. That one's ready to be. Oh, yes, I see. I see what I must do. I must jiggle jiggle at that one, and Susie must spare the first one. Recruit one of six. I got you, buddy. You ain't got nothing. Don't embarrass yourself. You continue to embarrass yourself, and frankly, it's embarrassing that you would do this. Get out of it. You won. 186 bucks. Ah, nice fighting again after so long. Now let's go catch up to Queen. Fucking high. Or not. Ah, oh, they calmed down. What What the dingle done? Hi, Rousey. I had to use my pacify spell and put him into sleep mode. The thing I could have done the whole time. I felt some fucked up shit and hurried over. It seems that a new dark fountain has appeared. Rousey, they got Noel. Damn. Who do you think you're messing in our dark world? If we don't do something, she might be... Worry not, Susie. All we have to do is seal the fountain again. Yeah, yeah. Can't be mad about another adventure, right? Come on, Chris. Let's do this. Yeah! Let's go! Oh, that's definitely a thumbnail. That's a thumbnail. Let's go! Scoop! Oh, we're doing this again. I assume I'm dodging these. I have to assume I'm dodging these. It's going well so far. Oh god no, oh god no. Don't get me wrong, I appreciate this music though, it's dope. Oh, this is cool. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's really cool. Seems fitting. Green field extends before you, and in the distance, a city shines brightly. You are filled with the power of a new adventure. I sure fucking am. But on that note, ladies and gentlemen, and you're going to fucking hate me for this, it's time to end for the day. Thank you so much for watching. This was a suitable introduction episode, I think. And if you're interested and you want to see more, then worry not. I'm literally going to sit here and record more of it. So I'm going to do this front to back. I assumed that was assumed by you. But that is the thing I'm doing, I'm confirming it in case you were concerned. Now I appreciate, of course, that I'm throwing my hats into... I wouldn't call it a ring, so much as a pile of hats on top of another pile of hats next to a mountain of hats. Everyone's doing this at the moment, I get it. And most people probably aren't gonna watch this one, because all the big people are doing theirs. But the first experience, the first time playing through a Toby Fox game, because we can basically call it that a thing by this point, I personally feel 
is an experience. It's almost kind of a magical experience because they're never what, quite what you expect. No matter how much you happen to know the games or his reputation or anything, you, ne you can never anticipate what's gonna happen or the dialogue. And there's something really special about it. So that is why I'm doing this because I adore these games. I adored Undertale, I adored Chapter 1, and so far I adore Chapter 2. I'm very much looking forward to playing through this, and I hope you enjoy watching me do that, because I have to assume if you're watching this, you're probably already aware of this game, or have played through it, or something, because it is free. But either way, thank you so much for watching, there will be more of this, I'm very excited, and I hope, for the rest of my adventure here, that I see you there. Toodles, goodbye.